Hey, what's going on beautiful people? If you want my 30 day raw food challenge, you can get it down in the description box below, giving it away for free for a limited time. Let's get into the video. I'm gonna show you a really, really cool hack that allows you to not have to rely on willpower or even patience for your persimmons to ripen up. Because as you probably know, persimmons are the one fruit that you can eat unripe. They're still kind of good in their crunchy state, or at least the fuyu variety, not the hachia variety. And, but you also know that even though you can't eat them unripe, patience is sweet. They're much better when they're nice and gooey and soft and properly ripe. So, what do you do when you buy them at Halloween and eat them at Christmas time? It gets a long time to wait for these suckers to ripen up. And, you know, but by the time they're good to go, most people think they're ready for the compost. They just chuck them out, but that's when they're actually good. So, what do you do? How do you wait a freaking month to eat a fruit? Or when they're just sitting out like this all the time, tempting you, what I do is I just, if they're sitting out like this all the time, I just come and I, I squeeze them, squeeze them, squeeze them, squeeze them, squeeze them, squeeze them, I, I squeeze them. And then uh, nothing changes, they don't seem to ripen. So what I do instead, it's like the phrase, like a watch pot never boils. Well, a squeezed persimmon never seems to, to ripen up fast enough. So what I do instead is I don't rely on, I don't rely on willpower or patience. I just take one of these locks and I lock up uh, a bunch of persimmons. Okay, one sec. One sec. Five, four, three, there we go. I take this lock and I lock the cupboards. And I fill the cupboards with persimmons. The persimmons here, and I've got more on the way. Persimmons I just showed you, you gotta add it. You can go persimmons in this in this pot in here. So I keep the cupboard full of persimmons, and then I set the, I take the key from the lock, take this key, and I don't want to be tempted with the key. You go from being tempted from persimmons by being tempted to the key. I take this, and instead I just put it in this, in this lock box. In the lock box, I can set a timer for it. Put that in there. Boom. Lock box. I'll just set it for 10 minutes for demonstration purposes. But after five seconds, the lockbox will go and then it'll shoot out. Just like that. And then I can't get the key. And now I don't need to think about the persimmons out of sight, out of mind. And then in seven days time, it'll go and it'll alert me that the persimmons are ready and I can go and I can feast on some nice, goopy, droopy, really ripe persimmons. So that's the hack for not having to deal with the waiting period of persimmons. Hope you found it helpful. If you want my 30 day raw food challenge for free, I, I've, I'm giving it away for free for a limited time. Just click the link in the description and I'll send it to you. It's freaking awesome. In it, you get a video every day from me talking about different ways to succeed on a raw food diet. So if you're interested in raw foods or fruitarianism and you want to uh, get some help with that, check it out. Link in the description, the 30 day raw food challenge for free for a limited time. Enjoy. All right, peace out, much love. Adios, have a good one. Bye.